Leadership Indianapolis announced the 47th class of the Stanley K. Lacey Executive Leadership Series this week. WRTV's Nico Panisi in studio this morning with what the program offers and its benefits to all of us here in Central Indiana. Nico, good morning. Yes, good morning. The program helps people in power become more informed about the issues facing Central Indiana. Many of the participants are presidents and directors of organizations that may be familiar to you. IU Health, Planned Parenthood, and the Indianapolis Airport Authority, just to name a few. Juan Gonzalez immigrated to Indiana from Colombia more than two decades ago. At that time, he says language was a barrier because there was very little translated into Spanish. And the composition of our community today is very different than when I came 24 years ago. Gonzalez came to complete his master's and stayed to be a Hoosier. He's the current market president of Key Bank in central Indiana and says the city grows more diverse every year. We try to understand how that affects housing and governance and, and health care. Uh, non-for-profit giving. I mean, all of those things that are important to, to us as citizens. Gonzalez is also this year's moderator for the Stanley K. Lacey Executive Leadership Series. The 10-month-long program provides knowledge, connections, and incentive to address and confront the needs of Indianapolis. Gonzalez is a graduate himself and says SKL helped contribute to his success. Give me access to some of those conversations that otherwise I wouldn't. It also has allowed me to meet other people through their network uh, that for business, for example, for what I do is awesome, right? Meeting other owners of companies that they know, they knew. 25 people will participate in the program, organized by Leadership Indianapolis and the Lacey Foundation. These emerging leaders come from a broad range of industries, like art, architecture, finance, and government. And that is an opportunity to get people from very different backgrounds, different sectors, different experiences, different perspectives, um, all in the same room to think about how do we come together to address issues in the city. Program director Rebecca Hutton says the goal is to make sure there's always a robust pipeline of community leaders ready to step up and take action. She says it's important to be multi-generational, multicultural, and collaborative. Somebody who is in an industry that is very um, kind of right-brained, like accounting, right, the numbers, they're going to approach something very differently than somebody who's from a creative sector, right? And, and the best and strongest solutions come from um, having both of those minds working on the issue so that we can make sure that we're balancing all of those perspectives. And the SKL 47th class will meet monthly from September to June, Raphael.